Hi, this is Ian Westerman. I'm the head pro at EssentialTennis.com, where it's my mission to bring passionate instruction to passionate tennis players, just like you. And in today's video, we're gonna be talking about a myth, to a certain extent, that you have to be tall, you, got, you have to be really tall to have a great serve. And that's just absolutely not true. And something I used to do, I, I used to kind of like to fool around with people, and this is kind of gonna be a little bit of a, just a fun video here, but there'll be some, some takeaways as well. Whenever a student, when I was teaching full time, would say, well, Ian, you know, I, it'd be great to have an, a, a big serve, but I'm not six foot five. You know, I'm just not tall enough. I, I'm only five foot six or whatever. So there's no way I'm ever gonna have a great serve. To which I would say, nonsense. You don't have to be that tall to have a great serve. And it's something I used to do quite a bit. I haven't done it in a little while, so, so bear with me here. Uh, after a couple of tries, I can actually get a pretty uh, good serve going from my knees. And it doesn't even have to be like a big spin serve, per se. That last one was relatively flat. And well inside the service line. So, I mean, what am I? When I'm, when I'm kneeling, maybe a little bit over four feet tall. So, if you're above four feet tall, you should be able to hit a decent serve. Now, would I prefer that I was seven feet tall? Does that give advantage? Does that give you know, geometrical uh, plus to you to be able to hit a little bit more directly at the box? Sure, yeah, absolutely. I'm not saying it doesn't make a difference. However, whenever I would do this, inevitably, the serves that I would hit from my knees would be substantially better serves than the person that was complaining to me that they were not tall enough to hit a good serve. So, so what is it? What are the mechanics that are at play here? Well, a big part of it is that most amateur tennis players that don't have a good serve have a very lateral delivery. Let me grab a few more tennis balls here. Most tennis players that have a really weak serve, it looks something like this. They, they line their, their racket up with the ball, their shoulders are horizontal, and they just kind of push the ball over, right? You've seen a lot of serves like that. The reality is high level players are making a very, I won't get down yet, are making a very vertical swing up towards the ball. And the only way to hit a good serve from you know, a, a four foot tall person's perspective, maybe a little bit above uh, four feet tall, is to really attack upwards towards the ball very, very well. If you, if you serve from this height and you hit the ball laterally and you try to hit at the box, the ball will never, oh, I just made that one. Uh, you, you've got a tiny, tiny, tiny uh, room, uh, I'm sorry, window, tiny, tiny window, tiny margin for error where the ball could possibly just slide over and make it into the box. The key here is to make a more vertical hit than that and hit a shot that has a little bit more shape to it. Even a relatively flat delivery, you can hit in a more vertical, direction, ooh, I got the back curtain on one bounce there, and that gives you a little bit more margin for error, and you can hit the ball more aggressively and still have it go in the box. So, just a couple random thoughts here. Uh, just wanted to have a little bit of fun with this and, and demonstrate a couple of those. Hopefully it's a little bit illuminating to you. Uh, you don't have to be six feet tall, certainly not six foot five or anything like that, to have a good serve. Now, you know, if you want to hit 130 miles an hour, sure, it'd be helpful to be above four foot three or whatever I was uh, when I was kneeling. But to be successful at your local courts, no, you don't have to be tall to have a great serve. So hopefully you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please do me a favor and click like. Also be sure to subscribe to the Essential Tennis YouTube channel so you don't miss out on future videos. If you have any comments or questions, leave those down below. Be really curious to hear your, your thoughts on this one, a little bit different. Uh, approach today. Thank you for watching. Take care and good luck with your tennis.